Hi friends, in the last two videos we have seen how to use VLOOKUP function in Microsoft Excel and in the second video we have seen how to use a VLOOKUP func function in two different sheet. In this video we will see how to use VLOOKUP function when the data is in two different workbook. I have the data, random data, which is present in the book too. For this alphanumeric value, I want to match with the numeric values which is present in the book one. The table is present in the book one, workbook one. So this is the book two data. We'll show the book one data. This is the book one data. So for this alphanumeric value, I want the corresponding number in the book two. So how to get that value using VLOOKUP? We'll see. Is equal to VLOOKUP. Press tab to lock the formula. Now the first parameter is VLOOKUP value. We want cell number a2 comma now the second parameter is the table array. table array it is present in workbook 1 so after pressing comma I am just going to workbook 1 book 1 see in the formula bar you can see the formula we look up a2 comma just select the range from which cell to which cell now you can see the formula has changed like book 1 so it is referring to the book 1 in book 1 what it is referring sheet 1 in sheet 1 what is the cell it is the range is from a2 to b10 so if you move after selecting the range if you move to the book 2 workbook then the formula will automatically change to v lookup a2 comma book 2 sheet 1 the range in the workbook 2 so don't go to the workbook 2 just complete the formula this is the most error which people will be doing while selecting the data from different workbook so just continue with the formula after selecting the range comma i want the data from column 2 comma i want an exact match so press false close the bracket if I press enter, it will automatically go to the book 2. So I'm just pressing the enter. So we got a desired output. See in the formula bar, the formula is a2 comma table array is from book 1, sheet 1. The table is already locked and we are taking fetching the data from second column from the book 1 and an exact match. So just autofill the remaining cells. Oh, this is a desired output. Hope this is useful for you friends. Thanks for watching.